Hey guys, welcome back to All About the Popcorn. My name is Stephanie. Y'all already know my sisters, Edith, Desiree. I already know it's another after the theater review here. Today we came to see, as you can tell by the title, The Forever Purge. Oh, also look out for a, pur well just for myself, a purge ranking. And um, that's gonna be coming up sometime this week. It's a very, very busy review weekend, you guys. I already have uh, two videos up. This is probably gonna be the third. I still have like two other videos to do, so just be prepared. So, the, the forever, am I boring you? <laughs> no, I'm sorry, I'm just sleepy. <laughs> Forever Purge. Let us know. We'll kind of go this way around. What did you think about it? I liked it. I liked it. Um, are we doing spoilers in any way before no. I before I make a comment that I shouldn't? No, let's not do like these people that die. But I mean, you guys already know. Probably they should already know the premise of it. This is the fifth installment in this franchise, so um, you should already know. But in case you don't, this is basically about um, the new founding fathers of America who made this law that allow murder and all kind of a crime legal for one day for 12, well not one day, one night for 12 hours. Everybody except um, class, like a high class people, class 10. class 10 are, you know, forbidden. Of course, in election year because of certain uh, circumstances that they were trying to do in that one that was revoked, but that was all because of an assassination attempt. But that's back over here. So they did reinstate the purge um, in this part because again, in the election year, it was removed, but they said, no, you time it's up. We want this purge back. And in the forever purge, they said, nope, one night a year is not yeah. enough. And in this one, it really does kind of go more so with what's going on, you know, in today's society with like white supremacy coming up, trying to purify the country. I mean, not get political, but you know. That's I, I, I enjoyed it. I liked it. Um, it's a purge movie, so you kind of expect a little gruesome. Mm -hmm. uh, a little, a, li a little out of control violence. Mm -hmm. A lot of out of control <laughs> violence some creative methods of capture mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but uh i enjoyed it i mean it's it's a purge i'm not big on, on on gruesome and i'll enjoy it but it does make me jump it does make me squirm a little bit Honestly, I, I, I prefer the scary movies to the gruesome. <laughs> no, I prefer slasher gruesome over scary. Yeah, no, I don't like scary movies. Even though this is considered a horror part of it, which to me, I don't see the horror. But, you know, I get it. People are dying, so that's... The horror is surviving. It's the horror part of it, but I can deal with, like, killings and stuff. That's... that's I'm good with that. I enjoyed it. I thought it was going to be, like, different other, like, areas of the story. I didn't think we were gonna focus like on one like of course main characters but I honestly thought it was gonna be like more more creative captures and more creative killing than the traditional just murders I thought it was gonna be more like the other ones where they kind of get a little bit more creative it's just but I enjoyed it I the ending's funny um, this one person is yeah, just, yeah, I already know Desiree with her words. All you need to know is that I liked it. I thought it, I thought it was going to be a little bit different than what it was. But I enjoyed it. All right. So I also did enjoy it as well. It's exactly actually what I was expecting from a Purge movie. Of course, it is different because this is the day after the Purge. The part that they do show them purging, um, kind of more similar to the first part where you really just get a glimpse of it um you do get a little bit more of a glimpse here but that's not really the main focus um in this particular movie it is the after the the fact i love how everybody really handled themselves especially ana del de, de la Reque? Recuera. Recuera? i don't know she's been popping up everywhere you guys she was in army of the dead earlier in this in the year that was her right yes. i love how she handles herself i love how she's picking these really like strong female and empowerment uh bros you know she's not this like oh my god like don't give me a gun like she's like no bitch you better give me that gun i'm about to like shoot everybody in their way and just like handle myself protect me myself and you know everybody that's around me i do kind of wish we had circled back around like um 
that's where he kind of said we're just focusing on this one group which i'm okay with because then it gets into too many like subplots or too many people but i would have liked to have seen maybe just briefly the boss you know how he yeah, went yeah. like did, did he find his family or not or did he die on the way um so there's just that kind of like open air deal but i mean not i think that big before i forget i would like to see her backstory is how she said yes. in the beginning. Oh, oh yes. Yeah. I honestly didn't even know that Josh Lucas was in the movie. I don't even remember. I haven't seen him in anything in a long time. Yeah, it's been a long time since I've seen him in anything. He did really good. We are in Texas, so yeah, no, I'm from Texas. I don't know if I should put this on here. I would've participated. We would've participated in the purge. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's put this. I'll stay home. Yeah, stay I'll home. stay home. We stay home, but we're not like going to extremes. Yeah. We just be fully armed just in case we need like to. if you, you come, come in, knocking you die rather not come knocking but if you come crossing my, my street i'm gonna be up on the, my roof with my sniper gun and then i'll get you like that but uh yeah that'll be like the only way like you know i'll protect my house because you know we poor like that and we don't got this high-tech security like these other rich people do and that's the whole purpose of this purge is to um i mean this one is to purify america but the other one is really to get rid and ha and and minimize the um what's it called the poverty line. I mean, overall, it was a good movie. It's, it's what you would expect from a Purge movie. I do like, like I said, um, seeing what happens afterwards. That's something that I was always curious about what happened with all the cleanup. So they did briefly mention, yeah, the cleanup has started, you know, picking up the bodies and stuff. Like Desiree said, the ending was pretty funny. Um, I guess, I don't know. I kind of wanted to say it on here. Okay, we'll just say this. Instead of having the American flag fly proudly, we have the Mexican flag flying proudly. And I said, oh, yes. And then the very end, the song there is a Cardi B song. It's actually really, really good. So it's worth staying just to kind of hear it. Or, you know, you could just look it up. Spotify, YouTube, whatever. It's a really good song. I really enjoyed it. Um, what do you guys rate it? I think. Mini. Large. Large. Damn it. I don't know what I would rate it. Like, I... Shit. <laughs> Like a, a, a medium, a very large medium, a medium with a soda. <laughs> oh, we're, are we, we're doing combos now? We're doing combos. Look, it's like a medium, like medium point five. Um, I don't know, like cause there's like parts of it that. So, so on the combo, which which one? How does it go? It goes. You start off with your small, medium, large popcorns, and then you start going into the combos. Where are we, how is this tier going? Uh, Look, it's my channel and my rating system and I make my own rules. Because it is it is enjoyable, but there's yeah. you know, there's yeah. those certain little parts. That's that why I went with medium be. because I yeah. don't I am like okay. I'm like, yeah. That's why I, went I don't with really, large. I don't really consider it a large, but it's like in it's like an in, in between. between. That's why I said a medium with a soda. Which one would you say the the first? I won't have you do um, all of my them. My first I think it would be part two what would you put this one and this would be my third the third one yeah it was the first purge it was okay now you guys look out for my ranking video so yeah i can see where this falls within my you know purge uh ranking all right of course before you guys click out of this video don't forget to give it a like subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet don't forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified each time that i post something new just a reminder i have a lot more coming this weekend so stay tuned all right until next time i'll see you guys at concession bye <laughs>